Happy Monday, Fit Family. So it's Daniela. I've been away for two weeks and I want to thank you all for giving me a little bit of break. Two weeks to take off. I had some family, some fun family times and I just needed to take a rest. So I decided to. So I want to show you a little bit of the rest period that I took. Um, can't go through the details, but did spend some quality time with family on a beach in a beautiful weather. After a long, hard year of this pandemic, you know, I was really careful. We were doing social distancing, wearing masks, but I decided that I just needed a little bit of rest. And so it was a great opportunity to spend time with my family. And that's pretty much what I did. You know, the last couple of weeks, I was wondering what I should be doing to show you guys to be productive and get ready for the year. But I realized that every day is really important. I'm showing you right now me walking to the library, which is one of my favorite places to go to pick up books. And yes, I still rent out books. Um, my oldest brother likes to make fun of me for it. And it's fine because it's something I love to do. Um, someone who loves to write, I love to read even more. And I'm just showing you the city. Walking around is pretty much what I do whenever I want to clear my head and take a break. And another thing that I'm showing you right now is just me trying to make the Magnolia's banana pudding for my other older brother whose birthday had passed and I wanted to make him his dessert that he loves. And this is the thing that I enjoy doing the most is baking for my loved ones. And it is kind of selfish because it makes me feel so good. I get to spend time with them. I get to see if they like my creations. It's something that gives me a bigger purpose, not just to be happy with myself, but knowing that I do love doing this. When I'm struggling sometimes with my depression, I will only bake for other people and really not let myself enjoy it, uh, meaning eating the food, eating the desserts. But lately in the last couple of years, I've learned that it's okay for me to also partake and enjoy. So this was really a fun experiment for me to do, which was make a dessert for my older brother for his birthday and really have fun with it and know that it's something that we give each other as a family. The greatest gift my family can get from me is my time, you know, and this is what I did for the last couple of weeks. I took time off and just really spend time with myself and my family to reconnect because during these difficult times of the pandemic and social changes and getting vaccinated and working and coming into a new norm, sometimes we don't really realize how lucky we are to have family. And I am very blessed to have family who is always there for me. And we share each other's passions together. We work out together. We talk about work. We just are supportive all the time whether we agree or not agree on the same topics. So, like I said, I just wanted to kind of give you a little bit of a heads up of what I've done in the last couple of weeks, taking time off and enjoying it. Um, I did kind of feel that I needed to come back with you with a new workout video or a review or something about weight loss and self-image. And that stuff is going to come up, but it's not going to be right now. I need to take some time off and really reevaluate about how I want to show myself to the world and you guys are here to see it and I'm going to be very openly honest with you and that's why I'm showing you a little bit of what I love to do which is baking sweets and no this was not low calorie, no this was not low fat, this, this was a dessert that my brother loves to eat and I know that he was going to enjoy it but it, he knows how much I love him by just making the dessert for him and I made a big container just for him and then I made a side container for his family and it was fun you know it was a fun time and that's pretty much it I think a lot of us forget to really enjoy who we are all the time and we always want to make each other we want to make ourselves better we want to get better at either working out or get a higher salary or everything like that but what I've learned this last pandemic is that I have to enjoy who I am in the moment. And that's something I take for granted. And I'm really struggling uh, lately in the last couple of weeks because I didn't have any time off. So then when I was with my family, I was with my family. I didn't 
think about work. I didn't think about me gaining some weight. I didn't think about any other relationships that I was working on that weren't going so well. I didn't think about any of those things. I was able to just take a break, have fun. I went on the beach. I went, read a lot of books. I played with my nieces and nephews. I played with my siblings, even though we're in our 30s and 40s. You know, we were running around the backyard having fun because that's kind of what life is when we are not busy taking on new challenges. So that was a good refresher for me to wake me up and remind me of why I do what I do, what I love doing what I do. I love working out. I love training people. I love giving someone a good workout, whether it's to de-stress themselves from work, to set a goal, to run faster, to lift heavier, to become stronger. And I give a lot of myself to my clients in the sense that I am very open of who I am. I'm not a trainer who is very lean. I'm a trainer who has muscle, has fat, has everything. And I always want to be brutally honest with everybody and, and know. That's why you'll see in the next video when I work out, I'll be showing my body. And it's not to just say, oh, well, it's okay for me to show you this because I'm open. It's like, I want to normalize a lot of what the world has taught me when I was little, which was I had to be always thinner. People think that we work out to be thinner. And for me, I did for most of my life. It's only recently that I realized I wanted to be stronger. And this is kind of what I'm going to be pro producing more in my videos. I want to thank you all for letting me have some time off and I'm coming back with some more videos every week, Monday at 11.30 a.m. They will be presented to you guys. Uh, next week I'll be reviewing a woman's health magazine to see how the workouts are and I'll be showing you a little bit about it. So I'm really excited because I usually do this too. I usually used to go to women's health or shape and see what workouts were there and it really drove me before it became to really work out and train and some of us who maybe are not training very really hard who are not lifting heavy or scared to is you can do that but i'm also looking at what everyday people are looking at and i want to review it and give you my little opinions about what's out there what's useful what's helpful and what is definitely not thank you so much for your time remember to be kind to yourself be kind to others and we'll continue to go through. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and leave me a comment. Be good.